Hey little monsters, we are doing another monster dice roll today. Good news is I found my other dice and also I have an eraser and like everything. <laughs> I fixed the problems from the first time and this time we are doing it with markers. These are Cali art markers that I've had for a while. So let's just get on started. I actually do have the proper ones this time. Also ignore the paint on my table. I was working on my boyfriend's birthday present. First up, D6, one or two, small, three or four, medium, five to six, large. Let's see what kind of monster we are drawing today. Four, all right, we have a medium monster. Hopefully you guys can actually see that, nope. Okay, I'm gonna switch to a different pencil. Is that literally any better? Eh, kind of. All right, we do have a D12 this time for the color of the monster. 12! We have a... We have a dark, and then we roll again to figure out what uh, color. <laughs> or actually, let's roll a D10 to figure out the color for this. Six, so we have a dark purple monster. All right, do we have hair? Odd, yes, even no. Odd, yes, we have hair. Odd, yes, even no on horns. One, we do have horns. All right, accent color D12 again. And we have to remember that it is backwards this time. That is a six. Da, 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 pink. This is going to be a very, very cute monster. We've got a D10 for the attitude. I cannot find my other one, so we're going to have this one um, where it's in the hundreds. That is an eight. We have a sh- Oh my god, this one's gonna be cute. She's shy. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be cute. Okay, so we have a medium dark purple monster that has hair, has horns, a pink accent, and she's shy. I, I guess I've already decided that it's gonna be a girl monster. So let's actually swatch some colors. I'm gonna grab all of my purples. Um, I know this one looks really light, but sometimes my purples will lie to me. Okay, Ooh, way too light. You can go back in. Sometimes with my papers, um, they look a little uh, darker than they really are. Let's see. Okay, you, you are in the lead. Ooh, or do we go with this one? Because that one's really not much of a dark purple. That's just more of a mid-tone. Oh. Okay, yeah, we're going to go with R926. That's what I was looking for. Okay, now pinks. I do have more options. Let's actually bring them over here. Let's see. We could go really light. So, do these two is an option. That's a potential option. I mean, like, I guess we can do these. That one's a little bit better. Eh. God, I'm just, like, not feeling any of these pinks, am I? Medium monster, it's two heads high. How I go with it is Siggy is one head, so it's really easy to do. So we're in the um I've had Foster's home for imaginary friends on the brain. So I guess I'm kind of going for like a um kind of looks like red, uh Terrence's imaginary friend. Except, well, cute. Can give him like a give it a little Easter basket. Maybe he hasn't found any egg. Maybe he's like not good at the egg hunt. Okay, this is actually really cute so far. Um. Hmm. Oh, what about a little monster? Maybe like a little Easter dress. We, we 
be a girl again? Oh, what kind of horns are we going to do with a square monster? This is going to be tricky. Um... Oh, that is cute. Okay. Okay, so what we're going to do is purple skiff. I'm kind of doing peach and then purple flowers on the dress, but... Let's now get some line art on her. Do I have... Oh, I do, I do, I do. You can do a purple Sharpie for liner. I like to do Sharpie line art. Um, oh, nope. <laughs> it's fine. We can just use a black here. Now we can fully erase all of this. I'm not sure what I'm going to name her yet. Um, for some reason, Beatrice is in my head, and I don't know why. This is what I like about my monsters. It's like actually coloring because my art style has become, I don't want to say simple, but easy. And just coloring them is a lot easier when there's basic shapes. I know the accent color was pink, not pastel pink, but I do have a plan for this. And therefore I needed a much lighter pink, because this is her Easter dress. So, oh, whoops, booked it. There we go. She is a very, very cute. Let's just grab um, a brown for her basket. That's a bit too dark and a bit too green. Still just a bit too... That'll work. Actually, no, or is it a bit too dark? Heck, yeah, there we go. Never think it'd be that picky. Hey, it's just a basket. You ain't gotta work that hard on it. And we'll just grab another purple just to give her a couple of Easter eggs. And we can have that pink one in there. They're a bit hard to see because the liner, but eh, it's okay. But here she is, our medium dark purple oh my god i forgot about the hair and horns oh my god i entirely forgot <laughs> um so i've been wanting to try this style of horns lately just like little wait 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 here we go i can never draw pigtails exactly right Wherever I I always have trouble. I might need to do a study on them eventually. Why does it give me Darla from Finding Nemo vibes now? <sighs> but here we go. We just... I didn't forget. You forgot.
She almost looks like she's strawberry blonde now. That is adorable. And this can be why she doesn't like Easter, as her horns are a little tiny and they look like bunny ears, so she's scared to meet him because people make fun of her ears, even though they're horns. That is adorable! That just, honestly, that worked so well. She's so cute. Even though she's shy. Oh, let's give her some blush. And who knows, yeah, we can do the weird little, like, me shading thing. There we go. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Okay, what can we name you? Um, honestly, I think I know. I think I know I said Beatrice. But... There she is. She is BB. Oh, so very much. She is so precious. Oh, I forget. She needs a date. So today... And she does need the Little Monster's signature seal of approval, aka my artist signature. There we go. There is BB. She is adorable, and I'm very happy to see her be added into the Little Monster roster now. Uh, let's actually turn her this way so you guys can see her a little bit better. There we go. Let's actually. There we go. There she is. She is adorable. I cannot believe I've realized that these monsters are really stretching my creativity already, even though I've only done two of them. I will say, honestly, part of me does like the design better if she didn't have hair. Like, she looks like, right there, she looks like a cat. <laughs> but I do love her. I love BB. She really makes me think of Dee Dee from Dexter's Laboratory, and at the same time, uh, Helga, I think is her name from Hey Arnold, I don't remember. I haven't watched Hey Arnold in a very, very long time. You can consider subscribing to the channel and following me on social media to see more of these monster dice rolls. Uh, I really like doing these. I've only done two so far. There is BB and before I did Homer. Uh, hopefully I can start thinking of better names. <laughs> Happy Easter, everybody. I hope you enjoy your holiday. Or I hope you did enjoy your holiday if you're watching this. Well, actually, you are watching this after Easter. So just Happy Easter. Sorry I didn't get this out sooner. But there we go. Hope you guys enjoyed. Without further ado, little monsters, I will see you next time. Bye!